We are gathered in the sight of God and in the presence of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. The Bible teaches us that marriage is a holy institution established in heaven by the divine wisdom and kindness of God, who said it is not good that man should be alone. I will make a help meet for him, and who again said they too shall be one. I can't completely explain to you how happy I am right now. Every moment, every second today, I can't stop thinking about you coming down that aisle, seeing you for the first time. And it's gonna be like seeing you for the first time in my life because for the first time I know you're walking toward me just to become my wife. And there's no greater feeling in my world right now other than that. I know already before anything that this is truly the best day of my life without anything coming even remotely close. I love you forever. You're my world. You're my queen. I love you, baby. about to take upon yourself a pure and solemn vow incurring serious and lasting responsibilities. The woman of your choice is now to become the partner of your life, the coher of your possession, the queen of your home. In no other way could she manifest her love for you. She leaves her home ties, companionship of friends, all these to share with you the joys and sorrows of life. With you she will now abide and for you, Brianna, you are also to assume important responsibilities. He whom you are about to wed will look to you for solace in the hour of trial. Your smile should be his brightest day, your voice his sweetest music, your industry his greatest wealth, your lips his faithful counselor, and your prayers his able advocate at heaven's courts. I love you with all of my heart. Life will get busy, and at times chaotic, but there's no one on this earth who can speak to my heart like you do. Bumps in the road will come, but I promise to always remain focused on the foundation of our relationship. I am so honored to finally take your name. I love you. Christian, I can't tell you how happy and excited I am and how excited I was to hear that Brie found someone like you. You're the perfect guy for her. The way you treat her and take care of her is amazing, not to mention your little girls. You're an amazing father to both of them, and that says a lot right there. I'm so happy for you guys, and I can't wait to see what your future holds. I love you both like my family. Congratulations. Brianna, you create a burning love within me, one that I want to share with and show off to the world. You have made me so inexplicably proud to call you my girlfriend 
and fiance, and I thank God with every particle of my existence the day you become my wife. We together have been blessed with an unbelievably beautiful, healthy, and happy family, which sometimes seems straight out of a fairy tale. But I can vow to you, Brianna, that I will never give up on us, that there is no force greater than my commitment and dedication to you and us. But I vow to make you smile every single day of our lives. Yes, I fell in love with you at first sight, but the choice has been mine every day since that day, November 24th. But baby, I vow to protect you and be your defender as you are part of me, and to do everything in my power to prevent you from suffering an ounce of sadness. You deserve everything in the world that is great, and I vow to bring you the joy and light to shine into our home and uplift you day in and day out. I vow to raise our children in the path of God and live by His word. I vow to be your hus the husband you crave and merit every single day without any excuses, without any delay, with nothing holding me back until the day I die. Brianna, my new sister. Your energy and your glow fills this area. And it's the same energy that makes Chris a strong man, a strong father, and now a strong husband. I'm happy that you both found each other and that you're gonna celebrate many, many years of lots of love and laughter and good times. And I get to be there to watch you do it. I vow to love you in all of our days, through the good and the bad, our highs and our lows, I got to take care of you, to laugh with you, to support you, to cherish all the thoughtful moments you plan for us. I got to be patient when it's easy to be frustrated, to teach our children that daddy's word is just as important as mine. I got to be faithful to you, to uplift you, and to always make you feel special. I got to be your wife in all of our days. I vow to deeply cherish you, Christian Alex Herrera, in the way that you have always deserved and cherished me. I love you. time when you get to a point where you know that you're getting old enough that you're giving away your daughter. <laughs> As I got to know Christian more and more, I, I uh, got to love him more and more. And um, I welcomed him into my heart as my son before they even got married. And so may you all always be blessed with a lot of love, a lot of happiness, and no matter what happens, always remember there's three things that make your relationship move forward. Honesty, respect, and love. I, Christian. I, Christian. With this ring. With this ring. Do wed you, Brianna. Do wed you, Brianna. And with my life. And with my life. I entrust to you. I entrust to you. By this act declare. By this act declare. In the presence of God. In the presence of God. And these witnesses. And these witnesses. Hijo, Brianna. Felicitaciones, soy el hombre más feliz del mundo en estos momentos. Me siento 
grande para mí para su papá y toda la familia estamos muy contentos de estar contigo hijo los quiero mucho bendiciones a montones besitos para todos los quiero gracias Christian got well this bride who now commits herself into your keeping and strives so to live in the Lord that no word or deed of yours shall clad her brow with grief or dim her eyes with tears. Brianna, it will be your part to strive to retain by your virtues the heart you have won by your graces. And to you both, I would say, let your voices not lose the tender tones of affection nor your eyes forget the tender ray which they shown in courtships today. And greatest of all, let God be enthroned above all else. From God, from whom God has joined together, let no man put asunder. I pronounce that you are a husband and wife, no longer two but one, in the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Christian, you may now kiss your bride.